You have to use baits when you strike. Now, same thing, mouse and the cheese or throwing a fishing rod with the bait at the end. You're baiting someone in to try and take something that looks really tempting, right? So if Mike's in front of me, my usual guard is like this, it's really tight. If I open up a little bit, there's a great big gap down the middle now. So he probably wants, it, wants to front kick, right? So I'm baiting him to front kick me. As he front kicks me, I'm ready to wait him to catch it. So I can then look to counter off that. So I'm making him go where I want him to strike. This is all done by manipulating your own body in a certain way. If I stand there and I drop my right hand a little bit, like this, then I might want to throw like a left hook to my head. So as this hand is dropped and starts to left hook me, I'm already here on the inside. Or it could be anything. I don't know. I, there's all certain ones that you can use that I've got in my arsenal, but I'm just trying to think of that. If I leave my leg out here, my go to kick it, I might shin check it and kick him straight away off that. A little bit more of a funky one. So you're blocking, but then knowing that you're going to counter straight off it. You have to set baits up correctly, right? If it's too good to be true, and my leg is way too obvious, so if I'm standing like this, and I'm like, go on, kick it, kick it, he's like, no, it's way too obvious, I can see this, okay? And it's too tempting, he won't throw it, it's just a bit too obvious for him to throw. So you can't make it too obvious. Also, you can't keep trying to force it. If Mike's there, and I'm just like, like this, I'm, I'm wanting to kick this leg, and I keep it out, and it's not working, and he might be throwing something else instead, just throw it a little bit, and then come back to it later, like five minutes later, whatever. You don't want to keep offering it. It should just be that little bait that they go, ooh, that's nice. I'm going to take that, and then you counter them straight away. So don't make it too obvious. Just, you've got to feel it, you've got, you've got to test them out, make them throw the shots that you want them to throw, it can be punches, kicks, elbows and knees are a bit more risky because they're closer range, and just give yourself enough time to react to it. If I'm standing this close, I want him to throw across, now I haven't got much time to react. If I'm standing a bit further away, he throws his cross, yeah, because I've dropped this hand, I've got more time to react, right? So give yourself time and space. So use baits when you strike.